Greetings, Earthlings. It's Shame with the Oddball Cart. It is July 25. Opening day was day before yesterday, but it is the first baseball weekend. I figured in honor of that we would maybe finish up Chris from Canada's Hobby Box. I am flying solo in the time machine. It is powered by chicken poop, duck poop that David Pert and I have put together. We are on the run from Dwight, who is slow and feeble, even though I, my, I tip my cap to you, Dwight, for besting me in the hangar war, but in real life, you uh, have no time machine and very few skills to catch me. Uh, we are opening Chris from Canada's hobby box. We have rested the time machine here in 1987 to try to chillax. Uh, the many accomplishments happened during 1987. Uh, Oddball is a 17-year-old doofus, but uh, starting to get his head on straight. Uh, here's our 2030 Alex Bregman. Very nice. This is hobby only if you're new to 2020 Series 2. So we are going to see Aretha Franklin get inducted into the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame this year. We will probably skip uh, Disney Euro going. Uh, I don't remember that being very well received at the time, but Oddball is also the type of dork that thought uh, thought Disney overpaid to acquire the Star Wars franchise. Uh, also made a prediction uh, back in the day. Nice Luis Arias uh, future star. The sucker for the second year Gold Cup or future star. He's off to a good start this year. Also predicted that uh, Avatar would be a terrible flop and no one would want to see it. Uh, it's only one of the biggest movies of all time. Luplo, Sam, Brett Phillips. So we're flying solo in 87. Back before everyone's face was in their phone. Also predicted, uh, just on a run here, I really predicted that no one would want to watch TV or movies on their phone when that first came out. So Oddball would have lost many, many hundreds and zillions of dollars if he had invested or not invested in that. I probably would still be investing in Blackberries. Oddball is slow to change. All right. Derek Fisher, Montas, Rangers, walk off. Let's see here. Since it's a hobby pack, we're hoping for some golds. Um, forgotten. I don't think we've hit a Shogo hitting. Ain't hitting none of them Shogo rookies yet. I think we've got a Robert Robert. Ro uh, I'm just going to try to practice it. How I believe the pr newest correct pronunciation people are saying. Here's a gold card here of... Uh, the Rangers is Robert. I'm, I'm saying it wrong, but that's just for your amusement. Uh, I felt like Dwight there for a minute. Like it all went above my head. Like I didn't know what was going on for a second. But, all right, we'll keep ripping these. I'm still liking Series 2. They seem to know that uh, it is a thinner set. And they seem to added some MSG and other fillers. Maybe some soy protein. Here's another Future Stars. I am seeing more short prints. Hey, there we go. This is a good boxer, Chris. He's got the Shogo and the Luis Robert. King Felix is sitting out the season. I was anxious to see how he could do with the Braves. No ill will toward anyone who decides to focus on their family or health during this time. But love King Felix. I do like this insert just because I'm a big fan of Moneyball and the war. Uh, look at that. Dwight Gooden. Good picture. It's like they decided they needed better photography and flagship. It's really impressive. All right. Yeah, we're clicking along at a good pace. I think we're going to finish off this box uh, and do a teeny bit longer than usual rip. So... 1987, Platoon is going to win Best Movie. These are, Platoon was a classic. There are any, many others like it, but this one is mine. All right. 
take a look here. Decades Best, Jim Rice, nice old school. This, uh, interesting that we're getting foils and golds of team cards. I know it's possible, but there we go, two for two. And this, what did we miss? A Dylan Bundy and a Travis whose last name I can't pronounce. All right. Well, so 1987, simpler time. Lots of traffic. Oddball was in the northern Virginia area. Lots and lots of traffic. Still didn't have a driver's license. Oddball is not the smartest fellow you'll meet. Delano De Shields, Adam Eaton, Hap. We are getting lots of future star cards. That is okay with me. These are for Chris, but uh, I'm the one here doing the critical evaluation, if you know what I mean. All right. Look at that. There's a nice card. They did a good job on these inserts. Grandpa Yaz. Mike Yaskrimski has been hitting leadoff for the Giants. So we'll just go ahead and finish off this box so Chris gets to see what's in his hobby box. That'll put us at about oh, umpteen cards here. All right. I, I can hear the crowd saying, less babbling oddball, less babbling oddball. Or maybe that's just my wife. but She doesn't call me oddball, but. Mrs. Oddball. All right. Happy opening weekend. I hope everyone is staying safe. Uh, that was my only oh, interesting 1950s Red Sox. I'll have to read about that. Didn't even know. Uh, that was my big concern. Baseball seems a little bit. I'm going to put that Gold Cup card down there, even though it's not Robles' uh, Gold Cup year. Baseball seemed a little bit behind uh, basketball and the, the safety precautions, so I'm pleasantly surprised. Uh, the big thing is the Blue Jays are now going to be in Buffalo as of today, the 25th. Would have been interesting to have them share the uh, Pirates Stadium. Strangely, they did. They had like one date that conflicted. That That would have been unusual, but anyway. Off we are. Here's a home run challenge. Yeah. It's a nice at least variation of Acuna. A collectible fellow. May not have heard of him. Rookie of the year in 2018. Even though Dwight is a big Braves fan. And Oddball doesn't recognize uh, autographs when he passes them by. Luckily you guys are here to keep me in line. Tell me what's what and who's who. All right. So I'm getting uh, texts on my BlackBerry from Sam for in Intercontinental Cards. Less chit-chat. More production. I like that. Hands-on manager. Many people uh, might take offense to being uh, coached by a Brit, not Oddball. Oddball will take it. The coaching and criticism where it fits. Sam is a funny guy. Runs a great channel. Editing. All right. All right. I got to look at that last one. I missed it. Garcia. All righty. Let's see. Two more packs. And then we will be complete with the hobby box. I don't have them all in front of me, but we did get a Shogo, a Robert. Seems like we haven't been getting too many in the 2030s. I know they are more frequent. A oh, nice Keston Hira. Um, but they are more frequent in the jumbo packs. I know that because I've bought and bought and I've done bought and into two half box breaks and got quite a few. Yeah, take a different gold. He had a nice home run for the Cubs. Hap. Last pack. Hot ball does not really believe in luck. You create your own luck. Be prepared for good things happening. But thanks again to Chris from Canada for letting me open his hobby box on the channel. Figured I'd do him a solid and not drag it out into one more episode. 
Uh, look at that. Hey, all right. Maybe there is such a thing as last pack mojo. I believe that's our second Robert. Very nice. Kind of makes up for the gold being a team card and the foil being it. Nice Yu Chang rookie. Haven't seen him play yet. Well, player of the decade. As my friend Gore said about that card. Duh. Uh, all right. Strasburg and Charlie Blackman. All right, everyone. Nice and subdued here in 1987. Catch you on the flip side. Duck thrower out.